I see we can go past three minutes, huh? The buzzer seems to keep ticking and continuing. <laughs> some people get to go past three minutes. Yeah, yeah, some do, some don't. Uh, Madam Mayors and uh, City Council, thank you for the opportunity to be here. I come here with mixed emotions um, as past union president, as past recruiting and hiring sergeant, and current sergeant on day shift in the North End. Uh, my mixed emotions, none of, none of them are happy. Um, as I've met with you over the years, we've talked about budgets. I've talked to each, most of you, and the first thing out of, out of my mouth was, how are we doing financially? And all your answers were doing great, we're doing fine, we seem to be plugging away. What happened? $20 million doesn't show up in two months. $20 million, $30 million doesn't show up in three months. You rid yourself of the previous city manager, interim city manager shows up, and financial director decides to talk, and now we have a budget crisis? It's absolutely ridiculous. I'm hurt. I'm appalled. As a recruiting and hiring sergeant, we, I stood here years ago, and we talked about the great opportunity it was to finally be at a budgeted level, the first time in 30 years. We take this step back in public safety, we will not get there for an additional 30 years. It's absolutely incredible. The interim solution that I asked of you is put a hiring freeze on. The city website still shows jobs open, and we're laying people off. Our website still shows jobs open. If you don't believe it, go to Take 5 and take a look. It's absolutely absurd. Each one of you bear responsibility for the financial status of this city. Each one of you should have known where we're at financially. And we're broke. We hired people, Florida, Oklahoma, Virginia, come here. We have a lateral incentive plan. We have something that you can bring your family here. Each one of you that I talked to, I said I was the ambassador for the city of Tacoma. You know that. I have a vested interest. I cannot retire until another 10 years. That will give me 31 years in the city of Tacoma. I have a vested interest. I'm not leaving tomorrow. I've got years to go. And my responsibility is for the citizens of Tacoma. We sit here and we're broke and we're cutting public safety. We can't go back to 1989. We can't go back to 1985. We can't take a step back because we can't get there in the future. We won't be able to. And if this is more, and a council member, I'm, I'm not sure which one it was that made a comment today, well, as long as I can pick up the phone and get a police officer, that's okay. But I'll tell you what, the citizens of Tacoma, you know in your neighborhood council meetings, deserve a professional service, whether it's police or fire. Thank you for the extra two seconds. What I suggest is to find out why this shortfall all of a sudden appeared when the previous city manager is gone, investigate the interim city manager and a finance director and find out why we're here. Other agencies and cities were laying off years ago. Why now Tacoma with this big budget shortfall? You guys have a lot to bear. Thank you for your patience. And I only ask that you do the right thing. And sometimes that's hard. And I'm not up here crying for the people that are going to get laid off. I'm crying for public safety. We're going to take a step back that we may never recover from. Thank you.